Tonight, a jury is deciding the fate of a man accused of shooting a Durham police officer. However, the defense claims the officer shot himself in the leg. WNCN's Maggie Newland has the latest developments. After deliberating all day long, the jury has gone home for the night without making a decision in this case. Carlos Riley's trial has gone on now for about a week and a half. The case went to the jury yesterday afternoon. Carlos Riley was pulled over for a traffic stop in December 2012. During that stop, there was an altercation between Riley and Durham police officer Kelly Stewart. The officer was shot in the leg, but there are questions about who pulled the trigger and how that shooting happened. The prosecution blames Riley for the shooting. His defense argues there's no proof Riley is responsible for the officer's injury, and the officer may have fired his own gun during the struggle. Riley faces a number of charges, including robbery with a dangerous weapon, assault with a firearm, assault inflicting serious bodily injury, and careless and reckless driving. So far, the jury has had only one request, to review the transcripts of the officer's testimony. But because of the length of time it would take to get those transcripts prepared and ensure their accuracy, the judge declined the jury's request, instead telling them to rely on their own recollection. There are 10 men and two women on the jury. They'll all be back tomorrow morning at 930 to resume deliberations. At the Durham County Courthouse, Maggie Newland, WNCN News.